Welcome back. I'm so excited because we are continuing to celebrate Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. Yesterday we talked about cuisine. Today we're talking art. Majority Rule is an AAPI art exhibit featuring eight Houston AAPI artists. And I'm joined by some now. Thank you guys for waking up with us. <laughs> so Erica, introduce everybody. Well, I'm Eric. I'm the curator of the exhibition. I'm here with Anthony Pabliano, Matt Manalo, and Brian Rama. And Matt and R Brian are organizers of the exhibition. So what made you decide to have this? I think this is such an important exhibition for Houston. Um, we have such a vast and um, really a strong presence of AAPI artists here in Houston and I thought it was really important to make connections between the work that's happening in Houston to areas of the global south such as Southeast Asia and South Asia. I'm joined by um, two of the artists Anthony and Matt. I'm really excited Matt I yeah. love some of your work so tell Thank me you. about this. Um, so my work basically talks about my personal immigrant story. Oh, uh, tell me about your story. Oh well my family and I immigrated here in 2004 okay. from the Philippines Okay. and um, yeah, so now I'm working as a full-time artist. <laughs> and so tell me about this. Uh, so the work, basically, uh, I'm using a lot of organic and uh, reuse, reuse materials. Oh. So, uh, you know, thinking about sustainability as well in my own practice, but also thinking about like how materials are being used right. and about the waste that also comes out of mm -hmm. my studio. So, you know, like, when when objects are being reused then it kind of like feels very personal for me being an immigrant and then coming to a new space mm. and kind of like having a new purpose i love the symbolism thank you what does it mean to you to be able to express yourself through art and to express your heritage and your culture uh i mean it means a lot to me you know i'm a very visual person i i've always been kind of like an artist as a kid mm -hmm. and i'm grateful for my parents for kind of like helping me see that right. and supporting me so, you know, I mean, I feel like it's the best way I can really express myself. I love that, and I love your work as well. So, Erica, tell me, what does this mean to you when you hear from artists and you're giving them a platform? Because I'm such a huge supporter of the arts. Oh, absolutely. I think that this has been such an important platform to tell stories that are often missed within Houston, within the works, as Matt was talking about, the different materials that the artists use and how those are connected to their home countries or places of origin. Mm -hmm. I think it really makes us um, think more about all the different types of artistic practices in Houston and how we can really celebrate that in m months like May and AAPI month. So where can we go to see this exhibit? It's up until May 21st at Sandman Studios. All right, and we are going to have all of this information over on our website as well. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you, you taking so the time to speak with us. Thank you, and thank you for sharing <laughs> your culture through art. I think it unites.